welcome back guys to the video so guys in today's video we are going to look at these two platforms called get grill and um, gig pay so they are virtually the same thing but they offer the same services but they are kind of different and um, I've been getting a lot of questions from a lot of people about these two platforms so in today's video I want to just do a little comparison between grill versus gig pay so we are going to be looking at in terms of ease of use the type of accounts their rates their charges and at the end of the video i'm going to give you my verdict okay so if you're ready let's dive straight into the video so um like i said we are going to be looking at grill versus gig pay their virtual bank accounts okay so um the first one is grill as you can see it's really easy to set it up. anybody as far as you're in nigeria you can set it up okay all you just need is your means of verification just complete your kyc and um, you are ready to go so once you have the account set up then it's cool the same thing as geekpay.africa you just need to go to the website geekpay.africa then you can sign up have your means of identification and um yeah and that's all you have an account so once you have this account so what you want to do is you want to create virtual account now for grill which is this one all you just need to do is go to this section then you Go set up your virtual bank account as you can see here on the screen. These are my virtual bank accounts. The same thing as geekpay.africa. Once you set up your account, go to this account section and you're going to find all your virtual account. Okay, so you, you can just create, click on create one here and um, create a virtual account. So simple. So, in terms of ease of use two of them are very easy to use and they are very simple to understand now in terms of types of account which is the second point here types of accounts they actually offer different types of account okay so um if you scroll down here this is my usd um account in grill as you can see here the name of the bank here is silvergate yes this is the name of the bank silvergate and this is the account details okay so for grill they offer you silvergate why if you go to geekpay.africa this is my virtual usd bank here they are going to give you wells fargo bank as you can see here so in terms of types of account they are different okay so grill gives you silvergate bank account virtual bank account why geekpay.africa gives you wells fargo bank virtual bank account okay so yeah they are different now if you talk about other currencies as you can see here for euros here they give you clear junction limited and these are the details if you go to grill as well let's search for heroes as you can see here heroes is clear junction limited they are similar they are the same now if you talk about pounds same thing you have um clear junction limited and the account details and um for pounds here is the same thing clear junction limited so in terms of uh, types of account they only have one different type of account which is the usd whereby grill gives you um silver gates why geek africa gives you west fargo now in terms of rates which is now another important stuff right here now if you go to grill.com um grill.co after signing up let's go to this home section here if i scroll down here you're going to find all the rates now bear in mind that this rate actually varies it actually changes okay so as at the time i'm making this video this is the current rate but this rate can change at any point in time okay so this is the current rate and if you go to geekpay africa if you go to this dashboard section here we are going to find their rates here yeah, this is their rates now so if you want to compare the rates they have here in geekpay africa to the one of grill you find it's kind of similar but sometimes it's different okay so as of the time I'm making this video now usd is um geekpay buys your usd for 6 672.35 and sell for 690 while grill buys for um 665 672.52 and buys and sells for 702 let me check the one of geekpay so i said geekpay buys for similar thing okay just that they are selling for 690 why grill is selling for 702 so it's kind of similar 
uh, it's just that little difference all right for euros and every other currencies as you can see they are basically similar 824 for gbp 690 for euros and then um, yeah 804 for gbp and 690 for euros same thing okay why they are buying okay so um i've seen this amount change very very differently okay so sometimes their rates varies but they are basically similar most of times okay so in terms of rates these two platforms are kind of very similar and they give you best rate okay for you to withdraw your money so when it comes to charges this is another place where um they are different okay for for grill.co they actually charge you one percent for let me go to banks so that i'm going to show you exactly so if i go to usd you're going to see that they actually charge you there's a one percent charge fee for payments made into this account so any payment you make into this usd account they are going to take one percent of that the same thing for grill now for for geek Pay africa sorry if you go to this account section for geek Pay africa we are going to find out that yeah they said you are charged only 0.9 percent when you receive funds okay so they are going to charge you 0.9 percent of any money you send into this wells fargo usd virtual bank account okay so they have charges is kind of similar and um different as well now one bad side of grill i don't know if the bad side is just something that geekpay.africa doesn't do is when you want to swap your money so let's say for example if i go to this balance section and uh, let's say i want to swap my usd to ngn which is nigerian era if i click on this swap font here this will pop out okay so i'll just choose maybe i want to swap it to ngn nigerian balance once i key in the amount i want to swap let's say i want to swap ten dollars you're going to see that there is a percentage fee i need to pay to swap this money as well okay so we are paying one percent for receiving money we are also going to be paying almost or the same one percent for swapping the money so they are charging us two two times or two places to do um things okay why for gig pay to africa you don't get those charges you only get charged for paying money in into this account now if you want to swap your money so let me go to the dashboard let's say i want to convert my money i'll just click on this convert section here and it asks me what wallet so let's say i want to i want to i want to convert um usd to ngn which is nigerian naira and let me key in the same ten dollars that i keyed in as you can see here this is the amount i'm going to receive sixty seven thousand and six thousand seven hundred twenty three naira five kobo there's no charge okay so i'm not paying for any extra fees any any extra charges for swapping this or converting this fund to ngn why if you try that on grill.co you're going to be paying some fees to to do that to convert the currencies okay so this is a different so they are kind of different in this um charges section here okay so you just need to know the one that is good for you and um the one that you can work with now one bonus thing i love about geekpay.africa is this card section here okay so with this card section you can actually create virtual or physical card okay so you can actually create virtual or physical card now what can you do with this card you can use this card to pay for stuff online okay you can use it to make purchases you can use it to pay for ads you can use it to do a lot of things that you're not not your normal um naira card can do so to create this card they are going to take three dollars from you and um, you just need to fill out the details it's very simple okay just, it's very simple you can just do that and um you can be debited from any of your wallets okay so once they debit you then you can fund the card and um, have the card working so yeah these are the methods to have to use the card so with this card now like i said you can pay for stuff online and you can use it to do a lot of stuff and you can get it as virtual or physical why for grill.c do that okay you can actually get a card right here so if you go to this card and recipient this is actually where you transfer your money into so these are virtually where you can keep your money where you can transfer your money into as you can see here you can i can i can transfer money to these three banks okay so but for grill you can also transfer your money to your account if i go to beneficiary 
you can see i've added my bank account so you can actually transfer your money to your bank account if you want and um you can as well fund your card and use the card to pay for stuff or to shop online or to do stuff that you want to use for okay so now um that brings me to this last point which is my valid okay so my valid is you need to have the two accounts okay so you need to have both grill.co and um, geekpay.africa so you need to have the two accounts because two of them actually can help you your business okay so you can actually use this um geekpay.africa to do whatever you want to do with your money to receive funds to do arbitrage to convert it and you can as well use grail to do the same thing okay where you add um some other platforms together so you can use grail to do that okay so um if you can create the two of them i would advise you to have the two of them and um then use one test out one and test out the other one and um see the one that works for you perfectly and um, you continue to use that platform so um this brings me to the end of the video um as you can see here grail.co and geekpay.africa they are basically the same thing just a slight difference and um yeah that's it so i believe um, this video was informative and you gained one or two things from it if you are new subscribe and um, if you have subscribed thank you very much i'll see you guys in my next video thank you